Hello friends, I'm Dr. Jeev Tram. Today I will discuss about chord presentation and chord prolapse. Chord presentation, a condition in which the umbilical cord is in front of the presenting part of the fetus with the membranes intact, not ruptured, called prolapse. This is a condition in which the umbilical cord is in front of the presenting part of the fetus with the membranes ruptured. Types of called prolapse Occult prolapse the prolapse cord is contained within the uterus, usually by the side of presenting part unnoticed. Overt prolapse, the cord protrudes into the vagina. Incidence Incidence of cord prolapse is 1 in 300 deliveries, more in multigravita. Etiology anything that interferes with the perfect adaptation of the presenting part of the lower uterus segment and disturbing ball wall action may favor called prolapse. Predisposing factors general multiparity, low birth weight less than 2.5 kg, prematurity less than 37 weeks, fetal congenital anomalies, breech presentation, transverse oblique and unstable line. Second twin, poorly hydroamnios, unengaged presenting part, low placenta, other abdominal placentation, fetus of male gender, artificial rupture of membranes, vaginal manipulation of the fetus with ruptured membranes, external cephalic virgin, internal podelic virgin, stabilizing induction of labor. Applying fetal scalp electrode, insertion of uterine pressure transducer. Diagnosis Difficult to diagnose, suspect if persistence of variable deceleration of fetal heart rate pattern, cord presentation, feeling of pulsation of the cord through the intact membranes, cord prolapse, cord palpated by fingers and pulsation if fetus is alive. Consequence of UCP, the cord is often compressed by either the shoulder, breech or head, a fetal heart rate pattern that suggests hypoxemia, severe bradycardia, severe variable accelerations may be the clue, especially in occult prolapse. Prevention of cord prolapse, high index of suspicion of cord presentation, care when performing artificial rupture of fetal membranes. Careful monitoring of fetal heart rate to detect irregular heart rate pattern that may suggest cord compression, severe bradycardia, severe variable accelerations. Diagnosed early or perhaps even prevented, risk factors such as malpresentation, polyhydroamnios, a high presenting part, or a structural anomaly should alert possibility of cord prolapse. Avoidance of ARM in cases of cord presentation would prevent cord prolapse. Making sure that there is no cord presentation before membranes rupture. Rupturing membranes gradually and guiding the draining of flow. It avoids sudden decompression. Methods of alleviation of pressure on the prolapsed cord. Alleviation of pressure on the prolapsed cord until delivery can be achieved through by. Digital disengagement of the presenting part, raising the maternal pelvis, Tredlin Bugs position or Sims position, filling of the maternal bladder. Delivery if the cervix is not fully dilated, prompt delivery through emergency caesarean section offers the best chance of favorable fetal outcome. If the fetus is dead, then manage labor is indicated. Complications of cord prolapse, fetal distress, intrapartum fetal death, neonatal asphyxia, early neonatal death, 